Hey guys, Gramps here. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to download and install and run MC Edit because I've been having problems with running. Um, as you can see, for some reason it's only recording top left hand corner of my screen right now. I don't know why. My recording thing's messed up right now. My mouse is like two inches diagonal to the left of where it actually is. So when it shows up on your screen, it'll be like literally two inches like if you see the mouse then go two inches backwards and that's where my mouse actually is um so yeah it's kind of messed up right now so what i'm about to do is click on my browser my default browser so i'm gonna put this in the corner hopefully you don't you can see all that um I like Google. You guys can use whatever you want. I still think Google's better. Whatever. Um, so we're going to go to this link. I'm going to put it in the description. The link is... That's the link. So you can pause it and look and like type it in. Or you can just copy and paste it if you're lazy like me. Um, so you're going to go there. It'll show up kind of like this, it'll just be horizontal instead of vertical. Um, it has, it supports Mac, Windows, and Linux. And, and this website, you can download MC Edit for Minecraft 1.8.3 and up. The reason I say 1.8.3 and up, even though 1.8.3 is the most recent update for Minecraft, is because this website actually updates every time Minecraft updates or every time Mac or Windows or this other brand of computer updates. So every time one of those applications or computers or um, setups uh, updates, this website updates with it and it updates its downloads. So, you're going to see for Windows there are two options, 64-bit and 32-bit. The only difference is it's just going to affect your FPS for MC Edit and your its ability to like save things and copy things and render things. Um, it doesn't really matter that much. It doesn't make a difference that you can actually see or feel or anything. So... I'm just going to do 32-bit because it takes up less space. So once it downloads, it's either going to be like on here for Windows. I'm using Windows. I'm not a Mac guy. I don't understand Mac. So if you're Windows, I'm pretty sure this is default. It shows up on the bar down here. Um, so... You'll see that if it doesn't show up there, like you changed your settings or something, you can just go to show all downloads. Just click on that. And then you'll see this MC Edit 32 bit. So that's what you downloaded. You just want to click on that. Or you can click on the other thing on your bar over there. If you have that. Then you just want to go to your desktop. The reason you want to do this is so you don't have to go through your downloads folder and look through your downloads folder to try and find this. So this will come up. So you just want to change it to desktop. It'll start out on documents. So you just want to go browse you desktop. I don't know how you get there. That's how I get there for me. Extract. And then this won't happen to you guys, this thing. Because this is just because I've already downloaded it before. So you'll just press extract and it'll start extracting. Um so now it disappears and you're going to be like, what the frick, where did my MC edit go? You just want to, you don't want to actually like shut it all the way down. Realize that I only press this so that it goes back down to my bar. Not X. This. Not X. Minimize. Not X. Minimize. Um, so then you'll have this folder. MC edit. So you're going to want to click into that. And then you'll go down and you'll see MC Edit. That's the application. And MC Edit, the icon. You just want to drag the application out. Um, this is the part where I had trouble. 
so you put it down there you click on it see how it only flashes its screen it doesn't load that's what's been happening for me um, the first time I tried to open it from the application on the desktop it did open but once I tried to open it for the second time it didn't work so if that happens to you where it doesn't open from the desktop this is what you're gonna do you're just gonna take your recycle bin trash bin whatever it is put MC edit file and MC edit file folder in there open back open the website back up you're just gonna wanna click on the same exact download doesn't even matter extract it again see how it starts on downloads downloads not documents sorry guys um go on the desktop okay extract close and then you're just gonna wanna open the f application from the folder um, it does take a little more time except for it doesn't really matter that much so you'll see it's in the folder you can just double click that and it'll open up as you can see so here's MC edit um, that's gonna come up don't remind me again um, I'm gonna close it but if that does happen where you can't open it from the desktop you're just gonna go into the MC edit folder and double click the MC edit application file and it'll open up just fine and then you can run it so if you think this was a good video and if it helped you please comment like and subscribe I don't care if your comments are dissing me off if you're saying nice job if you're giving me recommendations um, one thing that I would like to see is whether or not you guys want me to do a video on how to use MC edit um, it's actually pretty simple. I only know one feature right now. So if you guys do want me to do that, I'll research it and stuff like that. Um, so until then, bye guys.